Hello, everybody, and thank you for inviting us. Uh, this is Belen Lopez, and I'm coming with Ana from we're representing Arte Diez, which is a public art school in Madrid. And we want to present you a meeting that we are celebrating in Madrid for three years in a row now. And it's about design and digital culture. And that's the acronym for the, for the name in Spanish. It is city, Swiss. sounds similar to a band. Um, this um, meeting that we're, that we're organizing is um, joined, is made up with Media Lab Prado. It, there's the venue where it was, what is celebrated every year. And <clears throat> it's an event from Arte Diez, the High School of Design, Superior School of Design in Madrid, and, and Media Lab as the coordinators. Uh, it comes from well, for the idea of uh, having an event of public schools and more schools coming every year into it uh, about these topics of cultural issues on design technology, design and digital culture. And it's all very, very designed for, for and by students. And every year we've done, for example, the graphic images. It's done by students, like the, the logo. This is the logo from this year with the idea of the hashtag and the connections and the notes. Uh, this year it was done by these students from Arte Diez, from our school. But last year was done by students of the other school, the, the Superior School of Design in Madrid. And the first year also by one of our students. It's about, it's two days, um, in the morning and in the afternoon. And it's all completed with talks, pills, or short talks like this one. Also workshops, master classes, uh, and uh, a closing party at the end of the, la of the last day, of the second day. And for example, the talks that, the topics that we, that we assess every year is about user experience, or makers, or prototyping, wearables, programming, or this year we had some also on interaction, Internet of Things, and that kind of things. The capsules, um, it's an open call project, and um, there are many students presenting their work, most of the times for the first time, they do in a public space for, for professional people. But it's also open for, for professionals and for people from outside the school, so it's not only for students. Uh, we usually have four to six or sometimes eight workshops and this year we had some like on um, collaborative design or some with uh, one with ink and sound with um, conductive ink and making sounds out of it. Internet of Things, mobile first catch up or we did one for example on UX research, researching for UX user experience collaborative tools or Scratch. Some master classes like this year, we had one on ha the Hack Lab in Almeria, that is a Hack Lab settled in the, south, in the south of Spain in a very small community. And they talked about how to, how to introduce this technology to people who are not used to it and how to get small communities, small towns to get very interested into these topics. Unity, game design or information architecture. And it's all talked about uh, on the interest of teachers and students as future designers. So it's all very practical. And for example, the, the party on this last uh, edition was done by SPD Friends. On, it was a live coding event with uh, visuals and, and sounds done live and so as, as a gather up it's a, it's a, the, the EDCD is a free meeting supported with public resources and it's all open for everybody 
But of course, we, we need to have some help. This is all the collaborators and, and sponsors that we got to have this, this year. We had new, new schools participating and also for the first time com uh, companies to help out, for example, Telefonica gave out some, some of the workshops and we had some magazines sponsoring too. I have a picture of the people who worked this year with students also volunteering. Doesn't work. And that's it. So it's, uh, you're welcome to come to the next edition, which will be around March. 2017 in Madrid, in Media Lab Prado. Thank you.